Three advantages Ten Hag gains by starting Man United job early after Ajax exit. Incoming Man United boss Eric Ten Hag has made a major decision over his role at Old Trafford. Having already been announced as the Red Devils' new long-term boss, the Dutchman was expected to complete his move to the UK over the summer, with current interim head coach Ralph Rangnick stepping back into a backroom role. However, Ten Hag already seems keen to start work having terminated his contract with Eredivisie champions Ajax six weeks early and is set to fly to Manchester on Monday to start work with the Red Devils. That will see him miss the Dutch side's post-season trip to Curaçao as he aims to get a head start on work at Old Trafford. That could well see him garner plenty of advantages ahead of the 2022-23 season. Mirror Football takes a look at the advantages he gets by starting early. Whilst Ten Hag is set to be the decision-maker at United next season, outgoing boss Rangnick could still have an influence. The German schemer is set to claim a consultancy role at the club, whilst also having been named as the manager of the Austrian national side. It then remains to be seen how the dynamic between the pair will work next season, and that is indeed an aspect that could potentially be decided over the next week with Ten Hag set to be in the country. Rangnick has of course already suggested that he would be happy to impart his wisdom upon the incoming manager. Speaking last month, he said, I'm pretty sure he's got my phone number. Will Eric Ten Hag be a success at Manchester United? Have your say in the comments below. He's got another couple of games to play with Ajax, we have another three games to play here. Whenever he wants to speak with me and exchange our opinions, I'm more than happy to do that. There of course will be plenty more to discuss between the two apart from Rangnick's specific involvement in the team, including the tactical outlook of the team, as well as the makeup of the side. Despite Rangnick having not had the impact he desired at Old Trafford, that knowledge could well be crucial as Ten Hag takes the reins. Ahead of the 2022-23 season, it goes without saying that there are a multitude of decisions to make on the current squad at Old Trafford. A number of players have already decided to depart including Paul Pogba, Nemanja Matic and Juan Mata, whilst various others could be on the way out. Ten Hag could begin to make yet further decisions over his players, more specifically which individuals he will allow to leave Old Trafford and which he wants to retain. Those decisions could well lead to the Dutchman getting a better idea over where specifically he needs more bodies in his squad. That early idea could well see targets identified and moves completed, an advantage that United may well need considering the competitive nature of the upcoming transfer market. Whilst Ten Hag's transfer decisions have been covered already, one man that is worthy of his own section is Portuguese forward Cristiano Ronaldo. The former Real Madrid and Juventus forward has enjoyed a brilliant first season back with the Red Devils despite an underwhelming season in all. He has scored 24 goals in all competitions so far this season. Despite those fantastic numbers, Ronaldo has been linked with a swift exit. Of course, Ten Hag will be hugely disappointed to lose one of United's key players, particularly a five-time Ballon d'Or winner. With the Dutchman set to be in the country, he might have the opportunity to meet with the 37-year-old in person and finally establish what decision he will make over his future, whilst also potentially kicking off a charm offensive to keep him in Manchester. Indeed, Ronaldo himself has already offered his verdict on the appointment of Ten Hag, so the early signs are already positive even before former Ajax boss arrives at Old Trafford.